Right, ladies and gentlemen, this would make a beautiful addition to any sort of Georgian um, theme, sort of uh, table setting. I think it may well be um, Georgian. I can't give you an exact date on it. Um, it has no maker's mark, which again suggests it might be quite sort of early. Uh, and the shape is certainly highly sort of Georgian, and it's an unusual uh, shape. The item is quite light, but light not in the sort of cheap way, but in an elegant way. And there's some evidence from the way the the appearance of the interior, the way it catches the light, that it, the, the, this, the, the bowl has been hand hammered in some way. Um, the bowl is silver plate on, or silver um, uh, uh, of some kind on, I think, brass, whereas the handles are silver on copper. And there's nice sort of bleeding uh, where the copper shows through the silver and very slightly uh, in parts uh, where the brass shows through the um, uh, silvering, but that's less less frequent. Um, it's an item of some quality. The the the, this, the base um, rim here has been hand turned over, entirely hand hammered, which again gives a sort of Georgian look and feel to it. So this little rim has been very with a tiny hammer turned over by hand. The handles have been hand attached with solder, and as I say, the the surface of the interior suggests sort of possibly hand hammering. But I'm giving no guarantees about dates, but it certainly looks. Georgian in style, as I say, light, elegant, two-handled sauce boat, boat for your, your, your Georgian table setting. Rather unusual and just handsome and attractive on its own with a lovely, elegant, early uh, 19th century or late 18th century Georgian profile there. Thank you very much indeed. Bye.